With winter settling in and backcountry activities beginning, the excitement to get out and enjoy Montana's winter is a lure for some. But if you have plans to enjoy the great outdoors, it's important to brush up on some safety reminders before venturing out into the backcountry. Avalanche education seems to be working. Um, numbers of people getting killed in avalanches was spiking for a number of years. Even though there's a lot more use these days, avalanche fatalities have actually leveled off. And one of the key pieces of equipment that is important to helping with that leveling off is a transceiver. The transceiver transmits, but it also receives. When we go out in the field, we're on transmit. If we get buried, we're sending out a signal. The other people in the party turn their beacons to receive and they can follow that signal into us. Not only are transceivers a crucial tool to have at all times, but simply always keeping your head on a swivel can make all the difference. So I think the big thing is just to slow down, be aware of your surroundings and uh, just start that way with everything. Don't start too fast. Just slow down, get your equipment ready, take your classes and kind of, you know, go from there. And after over 25 years of backcountry work and teaching avalanche classes, Mike Miller knows the words to live by for anyone in potential avalanche territory. We would say, what's above me? What's below me? What's around me? What are the consequences? And so if you remind yourself of that throughout the day, um, it's a really good way to kind of catch yourself possibly making a mistake or, you know, it's a way to stay out of trouble. As snow continues to pile up in the mountains, it's always important to take any precautions available and be better safe than sorry. In Flathead, Carter Culver, MTN News.